So when it comes to aging, how easy it is to treat? Actually, it's become a lot easier. So does age matter when it comes to treatment? I've actually heard of 20 year olds and 30 year olds now doing more treatment than ever. It really depends on what's happened in their skin. And part of what the skin reflects is the muscle movement of facial expression. And some people are so expressive that even as when you're 18, you can already start seeing the creases. And so if that's the case, that's when you should get treated because you want to treat before the creases are real indentations in the skin because if we relax the muscles we relax the cause of those wrinkles and we can prevent them and we have treatments to offer for facial rejuvenation so let's show you a few of them there's resurfacing injectables and surgery let's take the resurfacing first doctor okay resurfacing used to be just co2 laser or erbium laser but there are a lot of different ways in which you can resurface, but resurfacing really means exactly what it sounds like, where you are taking off the top layers of the skin. And you can do it with peeling agents, so chemical agents will do it. You can do it with lasers, CO2 being the, that used to be the gold standard. Um, now it's fractionated, so it's not quite as good. Um, there are, um, there's also the erbium laser that does it, and it really is like a controlled thermal burn. Mm -hmm. So you are clearly removing the cells from the skin, and it has the greatest impact, but it also has the greatest downtime. And there are lots of other ways of doing it other than doing resurfacing.